Thank you, Mr. President. I personally don't object to animal cloning in principle, um, unlike most of my colleagues, it seems. But I do believe that the disproportionate call for a permanent ban could be damaging because there's this big assumption that cloning can only lead to bad things. Uh, what about the possibilities that cloning and scientific advance can lead to an improvement in the animal welfare? Now, that hasn't happened yet, I fully admit that, but that doesn't mean to say it won't happen. What is the sense of closing the door entirely with a permanent ban when we could go down the road of a temporary ban, which is what I will be supporting in the amendments, which would have to be reviewed on a regular basis, would give the opportunity for industry to go forward and start working on this without the possibility that they will never be able to bring any of their advances to market. I do not understand why this House wants to be so absolute without looking to the future with open minds.